<laughs> I mean, I do a lot of things. As you can see, I'm first to enter the garage and I'm mostly last to leave. I make sure all our equipment is up to par and I come in and check the vehicles out. I'm more like the, the go-to guy. If you want something done, you call Aaron. Aaron came out of our adult training program, Detroit Conservation Corps. We noticed his leadership skills throughout the program. He's one of those stories that you like to tell about. The story is, I chose the wrong path. When you gotta turn yourself in to go do 10 years, it's like, what you gonna do? So I tell my cousins, like, listen, we still young, man. Let's go ahead and do this time and come on home to the family. He's a returning citizen, came into the program for a second chance. We noticed his leadership skills throughout the training, uh, brought him on board to be a crew leader for that training afterwards. And now he's a full-time employee. He's our quality control manager for the organization. Trees provide critical benefits to our cities. They cool our neighborhoods and uh, reduce urban heat island. They improve uh, storm and flood water management. They improve air quality. They lower utility bills and provide a host of other benefits. So what we're seeing across America is that uh, underserved communities and lower income communities have sparse tree cover. That results in their neighborhoods being hotter, less economic opportunities, increased risk to vulnerabilities that are being impacted by climate change. I think trees play a major role in racial justice and equality. Uh, when you talk about tree equity. So trees are really climate action that we can take now to address some of those historical discrepancies and look towards climate mitigation in the future. When we go around and we plant these trees in certain areas, a tree keeps away pollution. You get what I'm saying? It cleans the air that we breathe. Bank of America has been with us for nearly a decade. They really understand the importance of tree equity and have been investing in greening cities and workforce development for nearly a decade. Workforce development is a major initiative here in Metro Detroit and actually urban cities around the country. What we know is that when you have a diverse offering of workforce opportunities, you can drive economic pathways. Providing tree equity through workforce development is one way to do it. It's a pathway to a livable wage job and a great long-term career, and it helps to re-green our city. Man, right now, working with the greening, which is like my family, really, um, it's been beautiful. They kept me from the streets. It's so like every time things got rough for me, I got promoted. So I just thank God for all that.